200 miles above the Earth, a net fired from a satellite is aimed at a potentially lethal piece of space junk. The debris, which was spinning out of control, is enveloped like a fly in a cobweb and will no longer pose a threat. The successful experiment watched with delight and no small amount of relief at the Space Centre at Surrey University, which developed the groundbreaking technology. And it's done it. Yes. It's got it. Yes, so the debris was spinning and the net went and captured it. A huge relief because you only got one, one shot at that. Indeed, indeed. And so everything went really well. So we are delighted. Space junk is an ever-increasing hazard. There are half a million known objects circling the planet, ranging from dead satellites to smaller pieces of metal. Some of the old satellites have collided, uh, some have exploded, uh, fragmented. So now there is this issue that you start to risk that a new satellite is going to be hit by one of these pieces of debris. Even the International Space Station could be at risk. It was from the space station that the cube-shaped satellite with the functional name Remove Debris was launched in June. The project, part funded by the European community, will attempt to use nets and a harpoon to snag threatening objects and has potential targets in mind. It's a very large satellite, a few tons of weight, the size of a bus. So that would be, for example, a potential target for a mission like this. Once captured, the junk will drop and burn up. A mission conceived in Surrey, making space a safer place. Paul Davis, ITV News, Guildford.